Currently, our Aquarius, yeah, going to be doing a reading for you for your near future. And we're doing some uh, guidance as well on how to deal with those energies. Mm -hmm. This deck is pre shuffled, just FYI, and see what we're going to get for you, Aquarius. Yeah. First card out, we have the Ace of Wands. Some sort of ambition, some sort of passion. Either you're going to be doing this or this energy is going to hit you. Some spark of inspiration, perhaps. Um, an energy inside of you that you really want to do what you want to do. <laughs> uh, yeah, yeah, that's what I feel with that. What could that be about? Yeah, something that has been on your plate for quite a while. Um, something that perhaps has been on your mind um, or something that you should have been doing all, all this time. I'm not really sure what this could be. You will know what this is about. Yeah, this is going to be like the time is now. I have to do it now. That kind of energy. Yeah, yeah. And yeah, it's, it's a heavy crown. That's kind of what I sense with that as well. So, hmm. Yeah. Interesting. Yeah. Celebrations. Good times, right? This could also be with another person. Um, but it's, uh, the most thing what I sense here is, uh, yeah, celebration. Yeah. So whatever this is, it seems like you're going to be doing it, even though it might be hard to do, right? It's going to make you feel accomplished. That's what I sense with that. Wow. That's really good. That's really cool. Yeah, it's going to make you feel like you're whole again. Yeah. With the Nine of Cups here, it's all about sitting good, sitting, um, uh, yeah, quite well. Uh, this is, see all these cups overflowing with energies, right? All about the emotions. It's going to feel you, make you feel accomplished, whatever this is. Uh, Ambition is here. All right. Wow. That's really good. Yeah. Going to be reminiscing about things of the past, things where you have been going wrong. This could be an energy of you going like, why haven't I started this sooner? Yeah. That's kind of what I feel with this. Hmm. Yeah. Also speaks of past regrets and all that, but uh, I don't really, well, you may be regretting this. Yeah. Why haven't I started this sooner? kind of energy yeah it's gonna make you feel drained sort of sense here yeah so this is gonna weigh hard on you whatever that may be all right so yeah i feel there's gonna be some guidance on that particular energy but um yeah something about doing this is gonna make you feel may actually make you feel drained yeah whatever it may be Wow. It's very kind of conflicting energy because at the same time, it makes you feel fulfilled, right? Kind of the scenario, what I get in my head is kind of like a uh, nurse that is uh, in it for the right reasons, not just money, but actually helping people. But at the same time, it's a very difficult job to um, uphold, right? Yeah, it's kind of a sense with this. Well, whatever this is, it seems like you're going to be taking a different route with it. Yeah. Mm hmm It's going to be weighing you so much down that you're going to perhaps change strategies. It may also push you towards something else here. Uh, yeah. Mm-hmm. Maybe a different approach because we got the ace of wands right there, right? I always sense that it has a meaning, the directions. Yeah. So, yeah, I feel you're going to be taking a different direction with it or totally walking away from it. That might be as well. But, um, I don't, I don't, yeah, I'm sensing more a different way of doing things. Yeah. Because mm -hmm. for some reason, you're going to be feeling very, yeah, not moving forward. So, what I sense with this. But whatever you're going to do, yeah. Yeah, and you're going to be doing a different approach, so it seems. Yeah. 
Yeah, absolutely. Because we had the Knight of Cups here. It's definitely acting on your emotions, right? How you feel about this. Got to be taking a different direction. And be taking action on it. Yeah. Because mm -hmm. you know, you feel in, inside yourself, your emotions are telling you that uh, this is not moving forward. Wow. That's interesting. Yeah. Empress, you... Mm -hmm. In the end, though, you're going to be um, creating something totally new. Absolutely. With this new direction, you're going to take it. Yeah. Yeah. Let's get you another card. It's definitely a creation card. Absolutely. In this reading, anyway. Yeah. Five of Wands. You could be com conflicting inside yourself. All, all about battles and all that, right? Yeah. Mm hmm yeah confliction inside of you wow for some reason you may know what this is when it hits you but it seems like overall you're going to be having some sort of ambition to do something it's going to weigh hard on you yeah can I have a celebratory feeling about it absolutely but then you're going to feel stuck with it yeah Mm -hmm. take a different direction create something new but that new thing is going to bring its own set of um, battles yeah own set of struggle yeah everything is struggle everything comes with a struggle <laughs> that's what I notice in uh, this human experience everything comes uh, not for free there's always something always something which is fine you know that that's fine but uh it is what it is kind of thing right all right let's get some guidance aquarius guidance on how to deal with these energies don't ignore the opportunity that has been given to you all right that's totally what i feel with that don't ignore it nope might be um this new direction right not sure but it's definitely don't ignore it make it happen whatever your emotions and whatever your intuition is telling you to do absolutely do it all right aquarius very important yeah magician energy Whew. wow yeah you must <laughs> you must do it queen of swords yep Cutting out the BS. No BS allowed. Yeah, so you must uh, really feel out what is real and what is not. Uh, what works and what does not work. I feel it has a lot to do with these um, two cards here. Yeah, especially this one. When you feel that you're not moving forward, you must really figure out um, with your left brain... Um, what that is and then let go of it all right i think pick another strategy because that, that's definitely a strategist card yeah it's not just all about the emotions it's tactical as well yeah and you're the emotions yeah <laughs> so it's really um um a balancing act of the two yeah you must look at logic and your emotions. How do you feel about whatever your uh, ambition is telling you to do here? All right. You're going to have to feel it out. Understanding yourself as well. Yeah. One day you may feel awesome about what you decided to do. And one day you may feel like absolute crap. Um, this is a calling for you to understand yourself. All right. Yeah. Because... The Queen of Cups understands herself, absolutely. She understands her emotions on why she feels the way that she does. All right. Wow. Aquarius. Crazy. Bottom of the deck. Guidance. Stamina. Yeah. Standing tall, standing strong. Seems like you're going to have to um, get some strength in your near future, Aquarius. Yeah. Pretty wild. Mm -hmm. Yeah, 
This is not defeated, okay? This is uh, going through a lot of stuff, but still standing. All right. That looks <clears throat> pretty complicated, but pretty awesome, Aquarius. Yeah, I like it. I like it a lot. If you heed this guidance here, I think you'll be fine. But um, yeah, it's going to be kind of like a, a mixed bag of emotions here. Ambition. And then things not working out the way that it's supposed to, but then finding a different way um, that will be fruitful. But it's going to bring its own set of issues. Yeah. All right. There you go, Aquarius. Do hit the like and sub. would be absolutely appreciated. And um, see you guys in the next one. All right. Bye-bye.